All right, guys, welcome back to All Things Outdoors. And today we're out here. And before we get started, here's some pokeweed. Look at this purple stem. Isn't that cool looking? It's growing all in here. It's got very pretty flowers, which are good for bees and hummingbirds. Well, maybe not hummingbirds, but it's good for bees and other pollinators like butterflies and many other things. But anyway, that's not the main topic of today's video. Here, we have some a marsh, basically, with the sawgrass. Ooh, it's marshy. But look at this. Now, you may be thinking, ew, that's disgusting. And yes, it does look disgusting. But it's nothing but rust oxidizing bacteria, otherwise known as iron oxidizing bacteria. Iron oxidizing bacteria is a bacteria, and it grows all over the world. Um, and it basically eats, it oxidizes iron, and it creates these yucky looking colonies in the water. Here's another, and this whole area is full of it. You can see it's all in here. Isn't that cool? And I'm not gonna touch it personally, but I will touch it with a stick. So I'm happy to do that. Whoa. Water in the ground. It's cool. Here we have a giant pokeweed stem. That is huge. Here's a older pokeweed stem you can use to touch this. Ew. As you can see, it grows on the stream bed. It grows pretty much everywhere. It's all in this culvert. The culvert's full of it. You can see there's a bunch of it down here too. Look at that. Isn't that cool? Anyway, that's going to be about it for today's video. So, once again, be sure to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications. Be sure to put that down in the comments below seeing that you did that for a shout out. And we will see you guys on the next adventure.